Is that blood? Do you see anything that isn't one of your camps? I hear rumors of our own people killing each other in Ariake. Traitors are preying on innocent people. They murdered the women and children of Clan Adachi. You can help bring them to justice. This map shows Ariake's lighthouse. We have no camps there, but people have said bandits have taken it over. Not bandits. Something worse. Lady Masako has arrived. I think she prefers to speak with you. If I was his nephew, I'd let him rot in that castle. Meme, how could you? Think about it. What have you learned? The headman of Kuta village might be at the lighthouse. Clan Adache built that for Ariake. This traitor has no shame. Sadao has men protecting him. There's no way they won't see us coming. Good. I want to give that traitor just enough time to fear what's coming. Let's go. Why would Sadao betray you? I accused him of stealing rice. Starving our people to turn a profit. You think he caused the rice shortages that hit Kuta? I could never prove it. But it was such a disaster. I knew he was trying to hide something. Bad men are good at hiding their true natures. Guards outside. The coward is hiding at the top. Come and fight! Show me the might! You killed Hina! My brother! 
They died because of you. You should have died with your family. I wish I had. Damn you. You killed Sado. Masako. He helped kill everyone I loved. And for what? To satisfy his pathetic hatred? When the Mongols defeated the samurai, I wanted to die with them. I threw myself into a battle I knew I couldn't win. It was... easier. How do you survive? I remember that I have people to protect. And the dead to avenge. With Sado dead, whoever is responsible will hear that I'm alive and hunting. They'll become afraid, make a mistake. Just be careful, Masako. You too. You are a part of this now. We'll find the other traitors on that list. But first, we must save my uncle. I'll be at Kaneda Farmstead when you need me. Sora. Basta, solo!
Kishi grasslands. Straw hat mercenaries were seen in the area. Too much smoke for a campfire. Mongo convoy. Ambushed. Could be the straw hats doing. Attack started here. But there had to be more than one Mongol. Looks like more bodies up ahead. Trying to get away from his attackers. You look like a scarecrow. You've looked better, too. <laughs> Can I have my hat? You're a mercenary now. Professional warrior. Maybe you can help me. I'm looking for your leader. He died on Komodo Beach. You were there, too. I lost a lot of friends. We all did. And we can avenge them if we work together. Help me save Lord Shimura. He's alive. The straw hats are hurt. Starving. I can't ask them to risk their lives for one man. Even if you can name your price? Once we free our home, Lord Shimura will pay you. Anything you want. My men might be interested. Your men? I look out for them. Someone has to. Do we have a deal? I'll think about it. Just ready. Hold your ground. I always do. It's worth a new alt! This is for Komoda Beach. Kill them all! Don't let them surround us!
improved. And you managed to grow a beard. Have you considered my offer? The Straw Hats can't save your uncle. We'll be lucky if we survive the week. It's that bad? We're starving. I was out here hunting for food. And I'm returning to my men empty-handed. But not alone. Take me to your camp. We'll figure something out on the road. <laughs> Just like old times. When was the last time we saw each other? Two summers ago. Lord Nagao's tournament. I looked for you after the tournament ended. The Straw Hats saw our duel. They needed a new sword. It seemed like fun. Why didn't you tell me you were at Komoda? You were busy with the other samurai lords. I was sharing a drink with my men. I could have used a drink before that battle. Yeah, I'll bet. Another wagon. Might have something we can salvage. Empty. Samurai! Samurai! Was this your wagon? Yes, my lord. Mongols stole my horse, took my rice. You're lucky that's all you lost. Which way did the Mongols go? Toward Fort Ohira. Damn it. Take refuge at the Golden Temple. Warn others to stay off these roads. Yes, my lord. Let's keep moving. My camp's not far. I meant what I said before. Help free Lord Shimura, and he'll grant you anything in his power. What's he got the power to give? He can declare the Straw Hearts a samurai clan, and make you their lord. On an island, conquered by Mongols. We will drive them out. Your name will appear in the Shogun's official records. You really believe that? I believe it's worth fighting for. I've always been a dreamer. It can't have been easy keeping the Straw Hats together after Komodo Beach. How did you do it? I convinced them nobody can save us but ourselves. That's true. I used to think so. But it's starting to feel like a lie. How many men do you have? We're down by half, but still enough to call ourselves a small army. Why? That peasant said the Mongols stole his rice and went to Fort Ohira. You think they're hoarding food there? Possibly. Do you have an idea? The beginning of one. Shinzo, it's me. He's here! You use those back! <laughs> About time. I don't see any food. Who's the samurai? Men, this is my old friend, Lord Sakai. Ryuzo told me you're starving. I'm here to help. 
You didn't find food. We have a plan. Raid Fort Ohira and take back the food Mongols have stolen from our people. Raid a fort? They'll kill us! Give us a moment. Come with me, Jin. We should have talked about your idea before telling my men. I wanted to give them hope. That's my job. I meant no disrespect. It's fine. Through here, Jin. If you ride with the Straw Hats, you have to look the part. I've got a spare set of armor that should fit. It better not have lice. Never letting me forget that, are you? Spare armor's in the chest. <laughs> You're not as handsome as me, but... It's not bad. <laughs> we should check the fort's defenses. Look for weak spots. My men will handle that part. Then we have a deal? Get us that food at the Fort Ohira. And we'll get your uncle away from the Mongols. Thank you, Yuzo. Just remember who's in charge of the Straw Hats. I would never dream of replacing you, my friend. Give us a head start. We'll meet you at the old cemetery. See you there. I pack the Mongols' black powder into a clay pot. I can set it aflame and throw it as a weapon. Men, we're moving out. I meant to ask you something earlier. I might have an answer. How'd you survive the invasion? I almost didn't. A peasant pulled me from the battlefield. She nursed me back to health. <laughs> you always were lucky. How did you and your men escape? We ran. Do what you need to prepare. I'll see you at the old cemetery. You deserve the best, boy. Here! <laughs> My lord, it's awful.
Diesel should be in the cemetery. Good. You're here. You ready to steal some food for us? Is this everyone? Just the men who can fight worth a damn. The rest are too hungry or sick. Let's hope we're enough to raid the fort. There's a better chance of seeing cherry blossoms in winter than getting that food. There's always a way. Preferably one that doesn't kill half my men. Scout's back. Come on. A lot of men inside, and a signal at the top of the tower. If they call reinforcements from the bay, we'll be trapped. They'll cut us to pieces. Find a place to watch for me. Once I destroy their signal, attack. They'll kill you. If they do, avenge me, and take their food. That's not funny. Watch the tower for my signal. If you say so. Signal the others. You'll see me light the brazier. It's time, Diesel.
Let's get your men something to eat. Where's all the food? I didn't see any in the tower. Did you find anything? Just a stack of Mongol papers on a dead officer. Let me see. You read Mongolian? If it's in Chinese, I can make out some of it. Since when? Since I had to read Sun Tzu. This was only a temporary depot. Taking everything. Offshore. The boats are in the bay. We'll never get out to them. We got in here. You're crazy. What did you have in mind? Let's see what we're up against. Have small boats on the beach. We could steal one, but we'd have to cut through their army. Too many barriers and archers. A frontal attack would be suicide. I want my men far away from the enemy's line. A flaming arrow might set off those explosives. That will get their attention. But we need them to look away from the beach. Put your archers on that cliff. The Mongols will focus on them while we steal a boat. All right, men. They don't know we took the fort, so they'll be waiting for reinforcements that aren't coming. Keep them busy long enough for us to steal a boat. Then retreat into the forest. Look for my torch. That's your signal to attack. Let's find a way down to the beach. You heard Yuzo. Let's move. We won't let you down. Watching you fight back there reminded me of Lord Nagao's tournaments. You did whatever it took to win. It was a competition. You fought just as hard. Did I? What are you getting at? Nothing. Just remembering our duel. We'll talk about this later. If we survive. Your men should be in position. Light the torch. Now, man. I knew they'd come through. Look at that fire. to move quickly. Take an oar. Can't believe no one tried to sink us. Your men distracted the ship's crew, too. Look around for the field. Nothing. I never knew 
gonna do what bothered you so much? Now you do. No luck. You should have told me earlier. Life took us in different directions. Anyway, it was a long time ago. No food here. Any sign of food? Not here. Maybe on the next ship. Hear that? Sounds like four or five guys. No way around. Surprise them. Greetings! Nice shit! You have to move. on the next ship. You bought your bow, didn't you? I gave it to my men. More Mongols. Take them. These look like battle plans. Better go find your Yuzo. You're assigned to it has to be something. Watch this, Betty! Stolen from us. Yeah. Use all. Okay. 
never quit. I would have had that Mongo if you hadn't shown up. I know. Did you see how big he was? That's where all our food went. <laughs> You're burning our food! He's up. We have to go. Can we swim? Jump! <sighs> Let's get out of sight. They're still hunting us. That's a good hiding spot ahead. I promised my men I'd feed them, and I'm going back empty-handed. We'll find another way. But how many will I lose before then? I found something that might help. Mongol battle plans. Do they show supply lines? One page has a map. It's a start. Hand it over. We do this together. You've got your own problems, and I am the leader. I need this, Jin. And I'll need you at Castle Canada. You'll have me. Don't let them see you coming. Just like you. I need to find Yuna.
fail to lift our tired spirits. Centuries ago, the warrior, Tadayori, saved Azamo Bay from pirates. My lord, please join me. Sounds like you have an interesting tale to tell, but I'm surprised to find you in Azamo. We both go where we're needed, Lord Sakai. My story is for your ears as well. Centuries ago, Tadayori Nagao was the greatest archer on our island, famed for his wisdom and perfect aim. The Kami Hachiman himself was so impressed he gave the archer his armor, light and strong beyond compare. In those days, cruel pirates raided the coast. They threatened the town of Azamo Bay with annihilation. The people fled to safety, but Tadayori faced the pirates alone, wearing his mythic armor. The pirates stormed the town. Tadayori's arrows tore through them. Few survived, but not one blow pierced Tadayori's armor. Years later, Tadayori died peacefully at home, but his armor mysteriously vanished. Some say his descendants guard it still, awaiting the rise of a warrior to defend Tsushima once more. The little writing about Tadayori that survives refers to a violet crown, a place in the north of Azamo, strewn with violet chrysanthemums, where Tadayori would often meditate. Driving the Mongols from our home is all I care about. This armor could help, if it's as good as you say. His armor is without equal, my lord, and I believe it is still out there. Find the Violet Crown.
violet chrysanthemums. The musician who told me the legend of Tadayuri mentioned them. They could lead to the violet crown. Crown. Tadayori's armor could be here. Incense. Burned recently. Something inside that container. A map to Tadayori's rest. More violet chrysanthemums. Tadayuri's rest could be close. If this are too sheer to climb, there must be another way in. Mongols, how did they find this place? A map, like the one from the Violet Crown. Tadayuri's rest.
Whose graves are these? Time's rushing river slows. Tadayuri's mind at rest. One drawn bow.